What is up everybody? Welcome into this new video to Express. Today we're going to be showing you how to add cloner inside your website. It's going to be a really, really easy process. So what you want to do is to go ahead and go directly inside your Shopify. So if you don't have a Shopify store, guys, I'm going to leave you the link down below in the description so we can all get started totally for free. Now that you have your actual website, what you wanted to do is to go and focus into settings. Inside settings, I'm going to focus directly inside payments. Now, the process of uh, actually focusing and adding Klarna is going to be really, really easy. What you can do, of course, is to open a new tab. Inside here, I'm going to open Klarna. And now here into Klarna, I'm going to go here into Klarna.com. Now here into the Klarna, what you want to do, of course, is to focus and hit into Logged In. Now, if you don't have an actual account into Klarna, you can always go into the folder of Klarna.com. And here, what you want to do is to aim for adding all the elements about your store. So choosing the actual business email as well as a confirmed of the emails. Now you want to make sure that your actual website, that you are the country is actually eligible for working into Klarna. If this one is not available into your website, into your country, it's going to be really, really hard to get started here into Klarna. If you go here and to choose a provider, uh, usually what you need to do is to type Klarna. Sometimes the actual cloner is not available into different stores. So that means that you needed to get started with a third party payment provider, which is different to cloner. Now you don't have to worry about anything here. What you can do is to, instead of going for cloner, choose a provider. And here into provider, you're going to go here into this section and enable the elements that I wanted to accept. For example, Google Pay, I want to accept uh, uh, Apple Pay, I want to accept American PayPal, I want to accept Visa, I want to accept MasterCard. And right now, I believe that the best suit for me is the Air Wallet. So the process to get started with, uh, let's say, for example, this kind of website, this kind of other third party payment providers is exactly the same as the Klarna. So it's a little bit different, of course, than Klarna, but it's exactly the same that you can aim for uh, if just in case Klarna is not available into your store. Another solution that I can give you, just in case you already have an account here into Klarna, what you want to do is just to sign inside Klarna and have access to your actual account. Once you're here into Klarna, what you want to do is to import all of this element directly inside your website. And to do that, you want to go here into Shopify and instead of going for adding a new third party provider, you want to scroll all the way down and go for the manual payment method. Inside here, you can import a bank deposit, money order, or create a custom payment method. So here, I can name this, for example, Klarna. And additional details should be displayed to the customers when they're choosing a payment method. So let's go for, for example, this method is, uh, I don't know, maybe provided by Klarna. And follow the instructions, whatever. So once you have done that, uh, here have the payment instructions down here. Now this is for displaying the customer after placing the order with the payment method. So for example, let's say uh, number one, place the order. Number two, go to uh, website, right? Number three, make the payment with the number, with the order number, for example. And there you have it. So here have the payment instructions. I hit into activate and now I can accept money directly from Klarna inside Shopify. So this is something that can be helping you to make payments outside your online store. Uh, manually must be approved before being fulfilled, of course. Uh, so it's going to be much more faster and easier just in case this one is not accepted, uh, of course, where you're actually currently at. Lastly, if you're based into the United States, you can aim for Shopify Payments. Shopify Payments is much more faster to activate. Just provide a uh, credit card and check out conversions. Shopify uh, is much more faster than Klarna, PayPal, and all those stuff. That's totally up to you, of course, if you wanted to aim for uh, receiving money much more faster. So guys, with that being said, we have now reached the very end of the video. Hopefully, this was a very useful information for you. Just in case you have any questions, you can leave it down below in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Hopefully, we can all see you next time. Remember, you have the link down below in the description to get started here inside Shopify. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching this video once again. Hopefully, we can all see you next time.